I remember the day when I was called uh, to become to follow Christ in such a way to, to priesthood. So I was pursuing to become an engineer after my schooling days, and uh, it was really frustrating. Whatever I do, I didn't feel fully uh, involved in. Uh, I was asking in the meantime, God, what what's your holy will for me? And asking through prayers. And once I remember, I went to attending a, a youth conference. So this priest, this particular priest, he didn't know me, but he just mentioned, he just came to me and said, my son, you have a particular call. Just, just pursue it, just pray for it. So I was, I was quite shocked and uh, I just went uh, after the retreat and went to my room and was thinking about it and, and opened my Bible randomly and prayed pray to God, God, if you're truly calling me, please, please guide me. And, uh, and I, was, was, I was fully shocked. Uh, three times, it, it happens, not once, twice, but it, three times, it randomly, this particular Bible verse struck to me, like God calling me to this, uh, this kingdom to serve him as his priest. And uh, this love uh, for priesthood grew ta in time, and, and at the meantime, my family is not opposing this idea. And I was in a bit of a struggle and uh, doing my engineering studies as well in the same time. And eventually, my prayer at work and my parents gave me the permission, and I, I, became, I came to Australia to join this con Confraternity of Christ the Priest community and uh, to do my uh, religious thing uh, to pursue priesthood. And I love to become a priest one day and serve God uh, in His vineyard to the, for the glory and for the salvation of the souls.